Hi there, my name is Ram Shukla. Hey guys, I'm Nabhan Ayub. So today we're going to talk about the very controversial topic that happened in India, beef ban. So wait, 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 wait. Are we going to stand here for a whole three minutes and talk about it? Don't worry, leave it on me. See. Abracadabra, gilly gilly, shoo! Whoa, nice trick, dude. Yeah, man. As you all know, India is a country of 28 states and 7 union territories. Officially, India has 23 languages. There are four major religions in India, Hindu, Islam, Sikh, and Christian. So if you're going to talk about India, it's going to take more than two days. So let's focus on beef ban. So according to the Article 48 of the Constitution of India, 20 out of 28 states have banned the slaughter of cows and other drought cattle. So you guys are wondering why the beef is banned in India. As you all know, 80% of the population in India are Hindus. And Hindus consider cow as being a holy animal and they relate it with the Lord Krishna. So by slaughtering the cow, they believe that it hurts their belief. Another reason is the ethical teaching of our beloved Mahatma Gandhi, Ahinsa. Ahinsa means non-violence and belief in the unity of all. Before beef was banned in India, India along with Brazil was the top global exporters of beef. In the year 2016, India alone export 1850 metric tons of beef. So, how did the beef ban affect the international market? According to reports, Indian export of beef is over $4 billion annually. And because of the ban and reduced supply, there was an increase in price of beef globally. Because of the beef ban, many international food restaurants has to change their menu. For example, Burger King and McDonald's. Those guys change their menus just because of the Indian market. They introducing the new Indian style burgers to attract lots of the customers from India. This is our little insight on the beef ban in India. We would like to thank you all for sparing the time in watching this video. And for last, we would like to thank you in our own language. What item, mummy?